I do notice, Craig, that the Korean girl has got uh, one of her legs very heavily strapped. I wonder how much that is going to cause her inconvenience in her movement. Then she rather relies on moving around the court and defending. She's not particularly aggressive on the attack. It's interesting to see just how this match develops. It's certainly a fast start by Tang Juhong. There she is. It was a super angle there from Tang Zhu Hong, the uh, Chinese player, but uh, I really did feel that the Korean girl was unable to lunge, and I'm really quite convinced from these early stages that her injury must be causing her quite a few problems. Zhu Hong going for the corner on the forehand again, but just too long. Service over. Last five. One five. So some sympathetic applause for Bang So Hyun. 19-year-old physical education student from Seoul. Again, slow to get across the court. Five, one. My research, Joe, would indicate that the last uh, twice these two have met. Uh, I think the Korea Open and the All England Championships that Tang Joo Hong won both of them. So it's the young Korean with a, a real battle on her hands. One, yes, the last time they met five. was in the All England final and uh, so Tang Joo Hong ran out the winner. The Korean girl was desperately close to winning in two straight sets. So if she could produce that sort of form today, they really are in for a battle. Five, so I one. serve. Ju Hong ready for it. Oh, what a lovely angle. And well in. Six. One. Yes, Tang Ju Hong playing some lovely angles here. Making her opponent stretch, but that one just out. These players have been playing in this stadium, Nagara, for the best part of two weeks. Uh, it's after a thunderstorm, and it's much quieter. Joe, there's normally a drift in a, in a hole this size. Where do you think it's coming from tonight? Well, as we look at it, uh, I think the drift is coming from the Korean girl's end, uh, making the shuttle go faster as she hits towards the Chinese girl. Sorry, it's over. One, Forehand corner, seven. cross court tight on the net, and Ju Hong can't reach it. Good shot. Look at the effort, but she was quite a long way away from that one. <laughs> Best rally of the match so far. Marvellous receiving seven. here from the Korean girl. One. Up it goes, ready for defence, gets it back, just hits the net. Oh. 
Craig, so I think that uh, already perhaps with One. the uh, storm outside, the drift Seven. has already changed. I think uh, what I said uh, one or two moments ago is actually wrong and the drift has changed. It seems to be now uh, coming fast towards the Korean girls end. Uh, must make it very difficult to play, difficult to control. Two, seven. Shuttle moving so much through the air. Let's see if we get an idea of that from some high clears onto the baseline on Tang Ju Hong, far side of the court. Service over. Seven, two. Lovely change of direction with that net shot could see that the Korean girl was slightly sl slow in moving there. Yes, Craig, there was a clear example there. Shuttle hit really quite hard by the Korean girl, but it held up in the air with the drift and landed well in the court. Spot on. brave spectators who struggled through the floods outside to get here. I would imagine that the crowd would fill up as the evening went on. Service over. Seven, three. Yes, the clear a little bit short, but a good smash there from Tang Zhu Hong. Good angle here, a half Three. smash, and the Korean girl just unable to reach it. Lunges low, but no, can't quite, quite make it. Eight-three, first game. First game always important, never more so than in a Uber Cup final. Five. Three. She goes for the net shot, takes it very low, it hit the tape, almost crept over. Service over. Eight, three. Just at the moment, game of errors. Points being lost rather than points being won. China, of course, as well as Singapore. Service over. Three, nine. Four. I think a few of the spectators calling for rather more action. Five, nine. Again, that drift just taking the shuttle just that little bit too long. Judged it well, five, nine, back in the game. Push deep into the corner. Five. Struggling with that lunge, though. Seven. Yes, and the world champion ready for that one. Ten. Game point. Beautiful net shot, but just five. look how far she is. And that takes her to her first game point. Ten five, she leads in the opening game.
Called in, 11-5 in the opening game, first blood to China. Game won by China, 11-5. That's the score, 11-5, Tang Ju Hong against Bang So Hyun, the last rally. Yes, again, a little bit of misjudgment here from the Korean girl. Slightly slow in her movement there. Good attacking play from Tang Ju Hong. She's really moving her opponent all around the court. There's the one deep into the forehand. And again, back to exactly the same position. And for a third time, a beautiful judgment. Well placed shot. Oh, the world champion isolated. Look how ready she gets. Any shot that may come over the net. No, Bang So Yun. Start of the second game. Test the shuttle. Black. That first game taking about 11 minutes. Service over. Last. All. Again, that suspect movement from the Korean girl. Tang Ju Hong's angle is superb there. She looks to me to be playing terribly well, Joe. Tang Ju Hong. Everything's crisp. She looks eager. Not only that, Craig, I think from uh, what we've seen in the first game, she's uh, very ready to attack. Bit of a wild one there from the Korean girl, sir. Again, Sang Ju Hong using the angle, trying to move her opponent. This deceptive cross court drop, the perfect answer. These two girls ranked highly in world rankings. Tang Ju Hong ranked two, and her young Korean opponent ranked four. Perhaps a little ironic that the girl who's ranked one, Susie Suzanti from Indonesia, undefeated in this Uber Cup, but of course Indonesia didn't make the final. She won't be seen tonight. Service over. Very good recovery here from the Korean girl. Nice cross-court net shot. Just reaches it and finds a perfect length. Well in. And again. One. So that gets her off the mark in this second game. Service over. Two, one. Uh, how quickly to use the angles. She moved her into the backhand and a lovely, lovely cross court too. Super stuff. Yeah, she really is finding the angles exceedingly well. And that's what she has to do against this opponent. Service over. One, two. But not that time. The idea right. And that shot hit the tape and fell back. And again. Two. Oh. Yes, Tang Shu Hong knows what she must do. She must keep trying those shots, making her opponent move from side to side and lunge deeply. But uh, just making one or two errors at the moment. Not with that angle, though. Sorry, it's over. Two. Oh. 
yes, here we see the perfect solution. That's exactly what she should be trying to do. That's the backhand cross court. It gives Miss Bang So Yoon a long, long way to go. A lot of the court to cover when she's trying to defend against angles like that. And again. Superb play. Attacking well throughout the rally. Three. Pushing her opponent Two. deep and then that lovely little cross court net shot. Just out. Service over. Two. just out. So, three all in the second three game. All. Judgment from Tang Zhu Hong. Thinks about it, leaves it, and on the line. Nice lift. There she goes. Perfect length. of unforced errors brings Six. out the Korean flag Three. and almost as if by magic there's a 6-3 lead for Bang So Hyun Tang Ju Hong must have rather mixed feelings about this arena she lost the Malaysian Open final here to Sarwenda Kusuma Wadani of Indonesia A Three. string of errors here from Tang Zhu Hong. She certainly wasn't missing those in the first game. Yes, that's three or four unforced errors. It's one after the other. In she goes. She's there early enough. Seven. Cuts it across, but it was really quite Three. a long way below the tape. that one well. Bang So Hyun trying to put a bit of pace in the shuttle after that. Missed the cross court. Service over. Oh, good smash here from the Korean. Eight. Gets quite well to it. Three. Straight down the line. Fast rather than steep but effective. was that. Nine, three. A shot 
but it was typical of the Chinese girl in the first game. Korean giving her a bit of her own medicine. Controlled that well. Ten. Game five. Three. So, ten three. Up goes her fist in excitement. She has this point to tie it up at one game all. And well judged by Sammy Tang Juhong. Game Three. point down. Ten. Tendency to hit those. She dashed it correctly. Shuttle landing just long as the baseline. Six. Ten. And Johan going again for that, that backhand corner. It's worked very well for her. Still in the second game. <laughs> Korean girl getting excited, though. Yes, here she takes the natural very early. Very accurate. Not a bad shot from Tang Ju Hong, but look how early the Korean girl took that. She rolled it over the tape. really joined here now. 6-10, second game. My goodness, that was a wild one. Way wide of the court. And she hung very ready there, but she needn't have been shuttled very wide Seven. of the sideline. Signs of the pressure, perhaps. Deep into the forehand corner. That got the error. There she is. She's really stretching for it. Can't control it. 
takes Tan Hong to match point to put China into a one love lead. takes the first match the Uber Cup final rather well, disappointing then for Bang So Jun from Korea and the delighted world champion goes off to accept the congratulations of her teammates so umpire 